Saving People, Hunting Things, The Family Business. Let's take a look at John Winchester's journal. Hey guys, my name is Jen. Today I'm going to show you my replica of John Winchester's journal in the TV show Supernatural. Here's a quick video of when I unboxed the item. I bought this journal from eBay for $68 and since it had to be shipped from the US, I had to pay $35 for shipping. This journal is made by a company called Conquest Journals. They specialize in making officially licensed planners and accessories for fandoms. The binder itself is of high quality. The size and look are about the same as the journal in the show. It came with news articles and brochures. Then here are the pages with content similar to the shows. There are blank pages too, so you can make your own content. It's already impressive the way it is, but I wanted to take it to another level of accuracy, so I ended up not using the pages it came with. And here, guys, is the product of my little project. I made the designs and layouts on Photoshop. Some sketches I made myself. Monsters which didn't have journal pages on the show, I made pages of. I visualized how John would have written about it on his journal. I made papers look old and distressed. It took me weeks to finish this, but I really enjoyed it. Let's have a flip through. Inside the front cover, here are John's military ribbons, which I acquired from different sources. So these are actual military ribbons. Conquest also makes replica pins, but I couldn't find anything at a reasonable shipping price. This is the Marine Rifle Expert Badge, the US Army Aviation School Fort Rocker Pin, the Bronze Star Ribbon, the Purple Heart Ribbon, the Marine Corps Good Conduct Ribbon, and the Vietnam Service Ribbon. Here's an old photo of John Winchester. Under that, you'll see Henry Winchester's initials embossed. Some brochures. Here's one for that tourist attraction called The Mystery Spot. From that episode where Sam was stuck into a repeating loop, living the same day over and over and watching Dean die each time. Here's one for Biggerson's, an old boarding pass, a $50 bill which is obviously fake. It has the signatures of Castiel and Crowley on the front and it says carry on my wayward son at the back. A matchbox label. And here inside the other pocket, a torn out page from a book. Not everything in this journal is TV accurate because I added extras to fill pages and pockets like this to make it look old, filled, battered, and really used. Here we have old photos in sleeves. There's John and Mary, some military photos. This is the Winchester's house in Lawrence, Kansas that got burnt down. Random number. Here's a newspaper clipping of the house fire. The first few pages are John's thoughts leading to him becoming a hunter and starting the mission to find his wife's killer. Do you remember this? Sam and Dean's initials, like how they carved them on the Impala. I placed stuff like this at random places to fill blank pages. It may not be John's entry, but Sam and Dean became owners of the journal when their father went missing. And I thought this is a nice little addition to the content. A page about ghosts, salt and burn, demons. Here's Sam's drawing of a tree on the Sleep Easy Motel pad. I drew this myself using a ballpoint pen. A list of names and locations. The Hookman. So here you can see I used a different font. You'll notice on the TV show that John's handwriting changes throughout the journal. The props department didn't really bother to be consistent in that area. Oh well. A filler about psychics and seers like Missouri Mosley and Pamela Barnes. A filler. This one's about that haunted asylum. Exorcism. Here's the devil's trap some symbols this is from that episode with the haunted painting do you remember it so creepy that yellow-eyed demon john was hunting a newspaper clipping 
Leshy, how do you kill it? By beheading with an iron axe. John's notes on phantom abductors. Another page on devil's trap. Mysterious disappearances. An old newspaper ads of the 1967 Chevrolet Impala. The veneer. A filler page as seen on the show. Necromancy. Vampire. Jin. A spread on Reapers. This is one of my favorite spreads. A spread on Saiyans. Crossroads Demon. Hellhound. Werewolf and Shapeshifter. And here the monster families of Duval and Lassiter were noted. The Vitala. Crowley. Do you miss him on the show? I do. A map of the United States. These markings are those places where Sam and Dean initially investigated cases in Season 1. A hand-drawn map. Croatoan. Mysterious Disappearances, a torn out page on the Whore of Babylon, Deva, Anna Milton's sketches while locked up in a psychiatric ward, some pages as seen on the show, Veritas, Osiris, a spread on angels, here's one for Archangel. Michael, Lucifer, Raphael, Gabriel. A page about Castiel. This one's a replica of that paper Dean gave Mary when he was teaching her how to banish angels. A page about the angel blade, the banishing sigil, holy fire, and warding. The Amazon warriors. An old clipping of funeral notices. Men of letters. A screen accurate page. Rugaru. Horn of Gabriel. This one, it's an old typewritten letter. A filler. This one you may recognize it. It's one of the most memorable pages from the journal and it's about the Wendigo. Some symbols. Dean's drawing of the symbol they found in a haunted house. It's that episode where this, the Tulpa, was the monster of the week. Zana. Goofer dust. Another filler. Old photos and ephemera in sleeves, a calling card, these are all how they look like on the show. Now this, the famous Dean page from the very first episode of Supernatural. Just some coffee stain there. The Eye of Horus, another filler. Knights of Hell, that's their crest there. Princess of Hell. These two pages are a spread of the four horsemen. There's war, famine, pestilence, and death. A filler page, Leviathan. The page with Daniel Elkin's name. The one with Missouri Mosley. A list of mysterious deaths. A replica of the Nephilim tracking spell stolen from the British Museum. Skinwalkers, a spread on Dreamwalkers, the first blade and the mark of Cain, a filler, a postcard from Lawrence, Kansas, another filler, pages on obtaining eternal life, I drew these symbols and Ouroboros myself, newspaper clippings and drawings, Here's Rowena, The Grand Coven, Book of the Damned, Black Grimoire, some spells used in the show. This one's a spread on the darkness, which is Amara. Filler, an old photo envelope, 
Inside we have an old photo of John and Mary. A page on fish tacos. A filler. An illustration of the monster killing gun made by Samuel Colt. Here's an assortment of photos and cards. There's Sam and Dean. Their very memorable group photo. There's the Harville's Roadhouse with baby parked outside. Singer Auto Salvage. That one's Lorleans. That bar in Alaska run by the Goddess of Luck, if you remember it from the last season, I think. And some other ephemera. Here's a burnt out page about the Striga. And lastly, some news clippings, etc. That's it! I love how this turned out. Now that Supernatural is on its last season, and there's only one episode left, and the journal did not make an appearance in the last two seasons, I don't think there's anything else I want to add to this. I love Supernatural, especially the first 11 seasons. And this is a great remembrance of me being a fan of the show. Please let me know what you think of it. Do you miss seeing the journal on the show too? Which props in the Supernatural is your favorite? Thank you for watching!